Hi, this is Zephyr Clark Dahlberg with Miami Dog Training in Miami, Florida. Uh, you know, some of the things when you want to consider when picking a dog bed uh, is how, you know, for one, how, uh, how big your dog is. You know, you're not going to buy a little bed for a big dog. So, uh, so clearly, once you've established which type of bed you like, um, you know, because they're all different kinds. Some are fleece and some are wool and some are nylon. They have, um, you know, scratch-proof ones. Some come with cedar chips inside to keep away bugs and to also keep the odor down. Um, you know, uh, different materials, different types. Now, um, some of the best dogs bed, dog beds can be made by yourself. You know, you get that egg crate, uh, egg crate stuff, that egg crate foam. Cut it to size, you know, maybe you want to double up on it and make it orthopedic because that's how they sell. You know, if you go on online or to Petco or PetSmart, you see the orthopedic uh, dog beds. It's more or less just the egg crate foams, you know, or, or a series of high density foams that the dog lays on is covered with, you know, it could be a sheet or blanket or, or if, you know, if you're good at sewing, you could actually just make a cover for it. Um, but uh, some of the best ones, you know, and easiest ones are homemade ones. Um, now, you, you know, maybe you want some come in circular, some are square, some have a little edge that the dog can lay, rest its body on. Um, you know, so there's lots of different options when you're considering buying a, uh, a dog's bed. So just whatever works for you size-wise and look-wise, you know, and smell-wise, that would probably be the best.